Wow, that looks different. progress done I still got more to do there's still a lot of little stuff but overall it's got a primer we can block sand it later and go from there oh I need to unplug that uh, unplug our heater when I get more ambition I'll finish that cleanup but I want to get back on the car. I'm going to move on to tomorrow. See what kind of trouble we can get into. Definitely a state boy. Thankfully it's not me. <laughs> Alright, day two of the fun. It's more like dinner time, so I don't have a lot of time to go. But uh, we worked on Mom's Island a little bit. We got pieces cut down so the back's done. Oh, you guys are zoomed in on my face. Sorry. Um, I'm going to open the back door. That's the back door. Let's go see. We're gonna see what kind of room we have to work with. Um, we went and picked up one of those portable garages. So it's like 10 by 17 or whatever. We're gonna see where we're gonna put it so that we can work.
how much you can really see. It got dark. So uh, I just kind of threw it up. It's not perfect. I still have to finish the bars on the bottom because I was dumb and I put them in and they're supposed to go through the bottom of this. So that'll be tomorrow. Then bring this, I'll bring it right up to the edge. Out. And this should be more than enough for the Mach 1. Okay, now I'll get the mode in here. Uh, So, right now we got the Kubota in, which is pretty good room. Probably do more if we wanted to. But we're going to put the mock in here. We'll tuck it back up against this edge. Should fit. And then we'll tuck anything else we can in here. And, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. All right, so that is today done with. Productive, useful. We put the Mach 1 away, that'll give us our lift back. So definitely productive. Um, yeah. So the plan is to get the Mach 1 off of there and out until I have the time, patience, and all that to fix all the stupid stuff. But we get that out of there. We have the lift back. We can do other things. Like if we need to use the lift, we can move the Mustang to the middle bay. Use the lift for our own cars or whatnot. It, it's just when we're ready to do that car, awesome. In the meantime, it's just in the way. So making our steps, making our progress. I am going to grab a drink and see what tomorrow brings. Huh. Forgot. Harvest moon. Full harvest moon. Huh. Wow. That's not something you get to see every day. Oh. It's not something you get to see normally on Thanksgiving. Definitely, uh, definitely an oddity. Ooh, all right. Not too shabby so far. I got some pieces to put together. Then we'll have to clean up this whenever it's nicer or not. It's gonna rain. Tools. Ooh. Head and sign and get this thing put back together. And of course, it started raining. Get in here and get started. Woo! All right, got the poles in the way they're supposed to be. And we have to go out that way. Fast quick draw. Whoop. And there's a couple trailers back there. One of those trailers is gonna have a Mach 1 on it. But it's raining, so I can't really have my camera out there. I may try and get a GoPro up on the Kubota, but We'll have to wait and see. I, I don't want to ruin my cameras trying to try, trying to do this. So let me mosey my way back to the garage, and we'll see what happens. I'll go get those trailers moved around. Wow, that looks different. So we got the Mach One pulled out. I didn't record it because it kept raining. It's just now starting to slow. And I didn't want to risk worrying more about video than moving the car. Um, we got it closed up for now. 
But <clears throat> beautiful. We have ourselves a storage area. Still walk next to it. Everything stays nice and dry. Got her tucked back in. And uh, we know the car is safe. So I'm ready to work on it. That is super important. Um, I'm gonna go inside, I gotta do a bunch of stuff on the house. Try and get her island finished and yada yada yada. So this is the end of the car episode. I may do a video, just catch ups, that it, you know, towards the end of the month, I'll get set up so everyone can see the final kitchen. Still waiting on the counter. Um, Oh, you win some, you lose some. to the car wait for Mackenzie. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are back in Gee Mom's kitchen trying to get everything finished off and we're gonna sneak this way. She got her new stove which looks really awesome. I gotta go ahead and get that leveled up. We buffed this countertop and this is her original that we had cut to fit with the farmhouse sink. So still gotta do the backsplash but Making progress. Now we have to buff this, I guess, because you can see the difference in the shine there Cooper shot. versus this. Now, what we found out is if you use a nice automotive buffer and a little bit of buffing compound, you can actually polish this up pretty darn nice. Let's go. Frank! <laughs> you don't want to sit there, baby. All right, let's see. It's gonna look like neon paint. with Windex. You think that's what's doing it? I'll bet you right now if I put Windex on this it'll dull it right out. Because uh, I do clean it with Windex. Use the granite cleaner and then we'll use wax on it. Okay. To seal it and whatnot. Okay. Purple! 
But yes, definitely don't use Windex. Okay. Don't look for Thank you. You can see a huge difference. Let's see if the camera will pick it up. Not a thing. Oh yeah, you can even see a huge difference in the camera. I'm a model. All right, do the other side. It looks like it. It looks like it did when you bought it. Now. All right, got that countertop all polished. We got our backsplash planned. We haven't done it yet. And then this will be, oh, sorry. So all we gotta do is the backsplash and LED lighting underneath here. You need two minutes and, right. and then this is the front face of the island. And Papa and I made corbels underneath to support the back side. And this is all oak. And one on each side. We also made custom shelf up there. And the coffee bar, which we have cups and stuff under here. Extra coffee. And this is solid oak countertop. Reverse osmosis system and oak cabinets holding all of the different cups and this is Ray Dunn. Right? Come on. Yes. Ray Dunn? Yes. What? Yeah. yeah. And this is a clock that we picked up. In the dolly. And then for the bathroom update. Oof. We got wood trim going in. There's the wall that we did. Still have some tools in here, but we redid this. Gave it a nice stain. I'm happy with it. Mom's happy with it, but she's not. She's not camera ready. <laughs> so, mom's happy. We're happy. Let's move on to tomorrow. Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. And as always, we'll see you on the flip side.